What is up, YouTube? Brick Lux Paint Name the Game. You know what I'm saying? And today we're going to talk about Naruto Storm for its first review that it just received, maybe like an hour ago. But um, basically, four people from Famitsu or Famitsu, ever once pronounce it. Four people from there, the employees, play the game for God knows how long, give a score from 0 out of 10, and then you add all those scores up, and it'll be whatever that score is out of 40. And that's how they do their ratings. So. From here, as you can see, it received 95%. I mean, I don't know if that's good or bad, because, I mean, well, if you want to compare it to the other Storm games, I mean, I guess it's a fair score. You know, with the highest scores being Storm 3 and Storm 2, Storm 4 placed in third with 38 out of 40. So, basically, from their perspective, they gave Storm 2, Storm 3 a better rating out of Storm 4. I mean, I wouldn't know until I played the game myself. I played Storm 3, it's still my favorite Storm game. Hopefully, Storm 4 would change that, and Storm 2, I never really played as much because I never owned it you know I played it, of course crazy amount of times but I never really had it myself to own so that being said I'm just going to go over some of the scores storm 3 got a 39 out of 10 as well as storm 2 and storm 4 got a 38 out of 41 point below storm 2 and storm 3 so generations received 36 out of 40 I mean I'm yeah I'm kind of surprised but I don't really care about their scores for the games you know I play it so I have my own score and stuff like that so these scores don't really determine the playability of the game for me because I will have a different experience from it so personally that's what I believe so generations for them received a 36 out of 40 surprise well surprisingly revolution got a 35 out of 40 it was the most balanced I would say out of the whole series and it doesn't deserve anything higher I would have did face cam did this instead but I'm kind of ugly right now so what else what else we have Naruto Ultimate Ninja Impact it received the same score as Storm Revolution I played that game very dull it was fun while it lasted it didn't really last that long and it was kind of boring Ultimate Ninja 5 which is one of my favorite Storm games 34 out of 40 I'm kind of disappointed at that score but then again I don't really care I'm just let you guys know and then the Gekita Ninja Tyson special I have that on my emulator on the PC and it's a very fun game that 27 out of 40 kind of uh Stab me right in the heart. And Dragon Blade Chronicles, no one cares about. But yeah, Storm 4, I guess, re received a reasonable score. But of course, when a full game comes out, I will be doing my own review for it. Probably on the Japanese version, since that comes out first. And just give my, just do a review, my opinion, the goods and bads. Talk about gameplay, story, layout, title, screen, character select screen. Pretty much all that stuff. And I just woke up if you're curious to why I sound like this and I sound dead. I mean, but yeah, that's pretty much it, though. Thank you guys for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. And put in the comment box below if you kind of agree with the story or do you like the way they do their uh, ratings for the Storm games and the other Naruto games. Thank you guys for watching. Stay sexy, stay beautiful. Most of all, stay Ninja Fresh. Stupid.